A music producer who has worked with at least seven Grammy winners and nominees works right here in the Triangle. John Plymold is here to talk about last night's show and some North Carolina connections. Thanks, John, for coming in this morning. Hey, thank you. Thanks well, for having me. Good well, morning. What was your favorite uh, moment last night? You know, one of my favorite moments last night actually was uh, not officially on the show. It was a, a commercial about halfway through the show uh, with Willie Nelson doing a cover of a Coldplay song, and it was actually a commercial of all things for Chipotle Grill, but it was one of the most creative and original things I actually saw last night, if you can believe it. <laughs> That's really cool. What about the North Carolina connection last night, uh, Bon Iver. Right, that was really awesome. Uh, bon Iver won, uh, I guess, two Grammys, which was really great. Uh, and uh, Justin Vernon of Bon Iver spent time here in North Carolina a couple years ago, and even though he's really from Wisconsin, uh, people here you know, definitely have a connection to him, and it was great that um, someone like him was able to win. As a producer, how did Adele do last night? A lot of pressure on her following the surgery. Yeah, definitely. Um, I would have been pretty nervous in those shoes for sure, but she did uh, excellent, I thought. Um, she's obviously very confident and uh, very, very talented, and for her age, she seems uh, incredibly worldly and experienced. She did great. I'm, I'm what about the, you know, there's always a rough moment or two. Uh, what did you see as a rough moment last night? There was one kind of funny moment um, during uh, the country act uh, Kelly Clarkson and Jason Aldean were doing a song, and uh, about the last minute of their performance, his microphone died, um, which is, you know, pretty funny when that happens on a show of that caliber. Um, and I've seen a couple instances of things like that on that show before, where, uh, you know, they're pulling an awful lot of things together for an awfully big production. So, you know, a battery dies and, and yeah, you lose right. a microphone. What about the Beach Boys number? Um, you know, I was pretty surprised at, at the Beach Boys tribute. Um, uh, it was Maroon 5 uh, was the first act that, that uh, participated in the Beach Boys tribute, and honestly, I really don't think they did too good of a job with that. Um, they sort of proved just how much talent the Beach Boys actually did have as singers and how amazing those records were, and they're not very easy to pull off live. It'd be sort of like me trying to, to uh, do a tribute to Nat King Cole or something. Someone else <laughs> should be singing that, not me. Well, John Plymouth, great to have you in this morning. Thank you for your observations on the Grammys. Have a wonderful day. Thank you, Bill. You have a good morning. Yeah, it's great to have his insight. It is 637 now. The U.S. government is using every means to boost the economy.